And back to our coverage of reopening Texas. And we want to talk about the salon that opened in defiance of the governor's orders. Nicole Jacobs was there when that salon legally opened this morning. And welcome to Special Guest. Salon Alamode opened its doors this morning in compliance with Governor Abbott's order at 7:30. It wasn't long before a notable client took the chair. I'm thrilled to be with you, and know the whole state of Texas is standing with you. So thank you so much. Thank you for your courage. Senator Cruz made his way to Dallas for a haircut at the salon that made its way to the center of the coronavirus shutdown controversy. Shelley Luther tells us Cruz's family has been nothing but kind to her following her seven-day jail sentence for contempt of court. She says she had a cell to herself but did not have an opportunity to make a phone call to her daughters until the following day. When asked if this situation has become political, Luther said this. You know, it's a nice gesture. Um, his family actually called uh, my boyfriend and prayed with him for 20 minutes while I was in jail. And to me, that's not political. That's just really nice people reaching out and making sure that our family's okay. Luther says during her two nights in jail, she had a lot of time to think about her purpose in life. She says with all of the donation money that people have willingly given her, she plans to give back immediately. In Dallas, Nicole Jacobs, CBS 11 News.